What's up guys? So I just got done playing a little bit of Fortnite. Yeah, so I stream on Twitch, uh, do that just a little bit on the side because I like playing games. It's like a little hobby of mine um, as well as cars. Um, decided I need to go get Coda dog food because she's running out. And um, I'm gonna go run to Sam's Club, pick up some like big waters and a couple other things that I need. And then I'm gonna be hitting a push day later on today. Or, excuse me, not a push day, a pull day. The powerlifting style of training or just using extremely heavy weights consistently, I feel like it's been putting a lot on my body. Uh, I've been I've been getting flare-ups in my shoulders, in my neck, uh, occasionally my elbow. I, I feel like I broke a rib, honestly, uh, from last video. I'm pretty sure when I like literally let it rest full weight on me, it might have cracked something. So I'll be pretty much aiming for uh, a pump or hypertrophy. I'm gonna be doing a lot of sets, a lot of reps, a bunch of different workouts, make it more creative. I'm gonna try to like have more fun in the gym. I mean, no, trust me, I guess I shouldn't say fun, but more diversity. I've pretty much always been coming in squatting, benching, and deadlifting, and then doing uh, like four to five accessories afterwards. All right, so I feel like I have enough strength, but I'm really looking forward to improving my size. So that back workout will be coming on later in the day. I just gotta get these two things out of the way, hit that. I might be heading over to the shop later, seeing Kelly, I'm not really sure. Honestly, I might even, uh, if, if there's a good Fortnite night tonight, I might even throw that in the video. I don't really know. But all I do know is that I'm going back uh, to the gym, or I'm going to the gym in a couple hours, and it's three right now. I'm probably gonna be there by like five, uh, four or five roughly. I don't feel like this is gonna take too long. I'm gonna be aiming for more muscle mass development than strength improvement. I feel like I've already put on enough strength, or I mean, I'm, I've am i improved my strength as much as possible. I'm, I'm like really almost pushing my limits, and that's why I feel like I'm getting all these injuries and things are starting to come over me because I'm, I'm kind of pushing near what I'm capable of right now. And I think that comes to lack of muscle mass. I feel like I could definitely put on more size in my chest, in my arms specifically, my triceps, I really wanna grow. Overall, I feel like if I put on more muscle mass, that's more muscle mass I'm able to train for strength and recruit those motor pathways and become stronger overall. Because you, you can be extremely strong, but if you have a lot of muscle mass, you can be very, very, very fucking strong. The more muscle mass I put on pretty much, the stronger I'll be if I train the correct way. I wanna take some time to go through a hypertrophy stage, strictly hypertrophy, really, really hone in on where I started because when I first started training five or four or five years ago, well, five or six, but I really started training. Uh, okay, I'm not gonna into it. We're gonna say five years. So when I started training about five years ago, I was only, I was a bro. So I pretty much, I trained uh, chest and triceps, back and biceps, legs and shoulders. That's literally, that was my programming for the first three years of my training. I did bench, I did squat, I didn't deadlift, but I would hex bar deadlift or I would, I would uh, do all, like a crap ton of back workouts, but never deadlifted. Um, first time I did deadlift, it was conventional, it was 455, that was literally my first time ever. So, saying I had enough muscle mass to pull 455 without any kind of strength conditioning besides football, which wasn't that great for an actual deadlift. So pretty much my training style back then was way hypertrophy based. I would do tons of different workouts thinking every little twist in the hand and arm made a difference. And although I, I was kind of naive, that also motivated me to train so much. I would be in the gym for three hours because I had to get through my workout without talking to people. I'm in the gym for two hours with conversation and long rests now. So I'm obviously not training as efficiently for hypertrophy as I used to be. That being said, I need to run a hypertrophy program for the next couple of months, really build up my size and stay on that and incorporate strength slowly back in. One for injuries, because I don't feel like dealing with them anymore. I've never had so many injuries in my life till now so that's saying something that's what's going down with my programming or my training uh i will i guess i guess i'll have to bring you through my workout i'll probably voice over or i'll probably just now nah, i'll just talk in the gym i'll bring you over walk you through my workout a little bit to show you what i'm going to be doing um and with this program being started i'm going to be releasing a new hypertrophy program in just a couple months i think my wallet's in my car i don't know where i left it it's not in here all right, so I'm gonna go outside, check my car, see if my wallet's in there. If it is, we're going to Sam's. Or, no, we're going to dog food first. Yeah, get it. But don't blame me, don't blame me. Good girl, good girl. Yeah, good girl, good girl. 
Oh, girl. Yeah. Good job. Jump. Good girl. Sit. Down. Good girl. Sit. Here. Sit. Paul. Good job. Good girl. What's that face, girl? Oh, you're fighting back? Oh, look at those teeth. <laughs> Coda. Ready? Sit. Catch. Good job. This is what she loves. This thing, she will go anywhere for it. I've been working on heel with her. Uh, she's not perfect with it yet, but treats really help motivate her. Once she gets it like recruited, um, where she like understands the command. <laughs> Aww. When she understands the command, uh, she'll do it without a treat, just voluntarily, uh, for like small rewards like pets and stuff. So I want to try something di different. I want to see if she'll hop up on the surface. New object. Okay, ready? Place. 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 Good girl. Place. Good girl. Place. Good girl. <laughs> She's catching on already. Place. 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 Good girl. Place. Good girl. Place. Good girl. Place. Good girl. She figured it out just like that. Place. Good girl. <laughs> you were right on that. <laughs> Paul. Good girl. Keep you on your toes. You'll associate the physical movement first, like me, like. She's still really good, like if I, she'll go down. She still memorizes that stuff, but she also listens to the down command as well. But if you're ever training your dog, it's really helpful to use hand signs. Here, sit, fall, down, sit, sit, stay, stay. Good girl. All right, that's enough of that. I gotta go. It's crazy how smart she is though. Like, I, I've never seen an easier dog to teach a trick. So I think she got enough exercise in. All right, you good now? You had a lot of fun? Be there in like a second i'm meeting up with kelly <laughs> all right so today i'm not going to be doing any deadlifts i'm going to be coming in and just doing rows as like my i guess compound main movement and then i'm going to move on to dumbbells and other little accessories but i'm going to cut deadlifts just for now just for this week uh temporarily and then i'll come back into them eventually but with a lot lighter weight so right now i'm starting with 10 delay rows Too many thoughts on my mind, I can't 
can't sleep at night, so I just keep writing. I don't need no help, I don't need opinion, so don't waste my time then. I just been living online, my city don't show me no love, and that's fine. Fuck local radio stations, I got more plays than all of these rappers combined. I'm going, I'm going again, I've been going in, I'm fed up with so many things, I gotta just let it all out. I'm talking about the shit they've been talking about, telling me I should do this, telling me I should do that, telling me, telling me things about rap, talking the truth and then stabbing my back, they will knock me off track. No, no, too many things have been building, been hard to deal with, I just been drinking. Remember my moves in the past, I'm wondering what was I thinking Lately I'm living in fear, wondering what if the end is so near All of this shit going on, the shootings are strong One shot to the head and I'm gone, I'm losing control but I can't let it go Cause I'm trying to get more and I've been in the moment I've been in the zone and I'm moving alone I don't pick up the phone when my family call, I've been doing it wrong And I don't know what's happening, trying to get what i just been imagining Getting close and i just been examining all of the fake shit the game has been packaging I've been keeping real, I've been doing what I feel, I've been down here all right, so the next move we're gonna be doing is just bent over rows uh, or whatever, lawn mowers. I guess like old days used to call them. Uh, it's just like an isolated, single-sided back movement. Um, gonna be doing three sets of 12 with it. Don't even like it. I won't be put in a box. Nobody telling me what I should rock. Nobody telling me what I should drop. Cause I do what I want and just know I don't stop. Recording till four in the morning, they snoring. I'm pouring my soul into every story. I'm writing, producing. I mix it, I master. I'm building my craft and I'm not looking back. I've been going doing things I wanna do when I want to. Everybody wanna get away, but they not do. Everybody wanna copy you, but they not you. Everybody wanna be cool, but they not new. So next I'm gonna be doing cable pull or uh, lap pull downs, cable pull downs. Uh, pretty much, it's a big lap movement. It's pretty much common everywhere. Uh, big thing about it, or a really good tip when you are doing it to get more lat engagement, is retracting your scapula and keeping your shoulders tight and tucked back while you're doing the movement. Don't let them come loose. Uh, it's a real good way to activate your lats doing it that way. Uh, and also, accompany lat pull downs with lat extensions. I don't, I, for lack of a better name for the workout, um, which I'll show you next. curls you saw I also like doing preacher curls I feel like it's a lot more isolated and it's easier to focus on one arm and on the bicep specifically you won't have any shoulder swing or elbow swing it's pretty much just a strict curl so preacher curls are pretty much my go-to for every every bicep workout Listen. 